Hey folks, Wayne Taylor, Honest Home Finder. I am out in uh, a Dior Horton neighborhood in Charlotte, North Carolina. You might have noticed I'm not always doing the neighborhoods, a lot more on the floor plans. It's just easy to do with Dior Horton. They've got so many different floor plans and you can uh, mix and match them with other, other neighborhoods and I'll definitely can find out if you see one you like, see if in the neighborhood you like. Um, this is Bellmead, if you're curious. It's not one of those neighborhoods that's uh, going away that I've been running into a lot. Just getting floor plans and not getting anybody excited about the neighborhood. But I want to say another phase is going up here and they need it. This is insane. How many homes are under construction in this neighborhood right now? They've got nothing to sell. I don't believe, I don't believe. I know that one of the reasons I'm out here is this house specifically, uh, the Concord, because it came back on the market and gave me an opportunity to video it because I don't think I have a Concord in my repertoire. Great room broken up a bit. I like this, just giving people choices and people giving themselves choices. We'll have this, have this closed off. You can still have an office right there. No, you don't have children. Don't need that bedroom. Just have it a little bit off from everything else. But it is, uh, don't see concepts like this offered a ton. And I think people like it because they, you know, if I'm entertaining or if they're entertaining and you have that mindset of, this is where the work goes on. This is where we're taking care of things. You know, I don't need the distractions of fans and friends, <laughs> family and friends getting in my business while I'm trying to cook. So this is just right off the beaten path. And if this is gonna be somebody that spends some time in here, look at all of this um, cabinet space, holy moly. So the pantry's got to be tiny because of that, is it? Is it? Yeah, it is. Cool. I cannot remember if I, that's just a pedestal stink. Sink. You're under the stairs closet. All right, let's head up. Here we go, here we go. Made it up. No loft in this particular Concord. But tons of bedrooms. I'd say the way this one is configured and I can take things in move things out when you're doing a build to a certain degree. I want to say that these secondary bedrooms are not as big as the view that I've seen and that more than likely you can find on paper. Oh, sorry. Start walking around. You'll find on paper that probably this isn't as big square footage wise as some of the ones that I've been into. So you don't have the bigger bedrooms or the huge walk-in closets. Not everybody needs that. Not everybody wants to pay for it. And this one is a little tight though. It's your laundry room. Off the hall. Safe to say the Concord isn't going to be my favorite one, but if it's your favorite one, hopefully this video is going to give you an idea of what you're looking at. So I promise you they weren't messing around. But I got the email stating that a home had come off the market, come back on the market. It's usually a means it was a fallout, which always makes me a little bit sad, considering I'm usually a buyer's agent. Uh, 
they had the caveat in that email that uh, they were taking offers until 10 a.m. the next day. So more than likely, this one's under contract. It just proves the insane, insane, insane times we're living in. Probably had a list. Anybody that's been through didn't have the opportunity to buy right then. Stuff like this to pop up, realtors would be in that mix like myself. Folks, top of the screen is my buyer's incentive. Thank you.